Hey everyone, it's Kenneth. Today I'm making a cart for my kayak so it doesn't take me as many trips to get from the car to the lake whenever I'm going out. Uh, I can put everything in the kayak, put the wheels on the bottom, and wheel everything down in one trip. Uh, I've recorded three times trying to get through the list of everything I have here and I've messed up every time. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to have everything listed in the description below uh, and you can go through there. Uh, I'll have prices as much as I can and everything like that. So I've already pre-cut everything uh, so that you don't have to sit there and watch me on the, on the saw. Uh, so I'm going to get started to put everything together and we will get this done. All right guys, so while the foam is expanding in the cart, I'll go ahead and show you the next project and it's gonna be obviously the rod holder that I'm recreating. Um, I've already cut everything to spec and I'll put all the items in the description below. You can just change the sizes of the spacers to make it fit your kayak. Um, with this, it's gonna be pretty easy. All I have to do is use the solvent and cement, put everything together and it'll pretty much be ready for paint to match the kayak. So I'll get busy on this and I will show you the outcome. Alright guys, so as you can see I put everything together. Uh, that's kind of how it looks like when I'm storing it. Uh, normally whenever I'm out on the water I flip out the, the trolling arms and uh, let me move that so you can get a better look. Zoom in on it. So yeah, as you can see I made everything out of a uh, two inch PVC. Um, it fits perfectly in my kayak and here in just a moment, I'm, once the, the cart's done, I'm going to put everything together. I'm going to paint it up to where everything matches and looks like it belongs and uh, I'll, I'll show you guys what that looks like afterwards. Alright guys, so as you can see, I've completed the cart as well as the rod holder. 
Uh, you know, the painting uh, didn't go too well. I got some drips and everything like that. Still need to do another coat, but I'm gonna go ahead and end for the, tonight. It's already 10.30 and I'm gonna be on the lake at 5.30 in the morning, so. Um, I think it's an overall success and uh, we'll see how it all works out. Thanks for watching.